Hello and welcome to another Spotlight Photographics tutorial video. My name is Sean Dement with Spotlight Photographics and Photo Solutions Market. Today we'll be talking about the new Groundbreaker series template, the Soccer Design. And this is a brand new design that just came out in addition to the other already made uh, Groundbreakers and this one is themed for soccer. Uh, it has a lot of color changing ability to it. You can move a lot of elements around and really create you know, everything that you want to do using this template for soccer. Uh, it is laid out on a 2 by 3 ratio, which means you're going to be able to print 20 by 30s, um, well, 12 by 18s, 20 by 30s, 24 by 36, all the way up to a 4 foot by 6 foot banner using the exact dimensions that's in there now. You can, however, adjust the ratios, and I would uh, advise you to watch the adjustment ratio tutorial we have on our website, photosolutionsmarket.com, click on the upper right hand corner help tab and you'll be able to see spotlight tutorials right there and we have a lot of different tutorials on how to do uh, things outside of the normal uh, color changing and, and editing of the templates, for example the uh, adjustment layers. So we're going to go through this template real quick and change the colors just so you can see how you can do that. Um, the first thing we're going to do is I'm going to come into the layer for the players and we'll go ahead and turn that off so we can just see the template. So we're going to come down to the very bottom and you'll notice all of these layers that have a blue color on them, those are your color changing layers. This is something brand new that I've started doing with the templates to help you find the layers quicker uh, that you have color changing abilities on. So we'll come down here to the first one, we have a hue and saturation layer. We'll just double click right here and that's going to open up our slider bar and then we can slide this to whatever color that we want and you'll notice it's changing the lights in the upper right hand side. Now it's going to stay with the same saturation layer that level that it was there before. Uh, however, it's going to be a little bit different. For example, that's a little lighter green. So if we want that to be deeper, we'll just bring our saturation up to where we want it to be. So if we're going to change this over to green. I'm going to remember this color code now, uh, the, the color adjustments numbers here, so that everything else that I change is going to be the same. So I've got 114 and 78. So um, we'll just remember 114 and 78 for those two and we'll just work our way up the template to our next one and we'll do 148 and 17 I think I was wrong about that 114 and 78 I never write it down and 78. There we go. And we'll go to the next one. And we'll do 114 and 78. There we go. We got one more. There we go. And we just keep working our way up, finding all of those color adjustments. And the last one here. All right, so we've changed this one all the way over to green. And now we'll go ahead and change the text. To do that, we'll just use our text tool. Just highlight the word strikers. And we'll say this team's name was the Hounds. And that's all we've got to do. Now, the one thing about this template that you'll notice is this word has kind of a see-through look to it and that is simply a blending mode. So once we're on the mascot name layer here, we'll come up to the overlay you'll see up here and we can change this to different uh, looks. And that way we can get the exact way we want it. Now if you notice that the text is blue right now. So if we come up to our character and click on the color for this, we can change this over to green and get more of the look that we're looking for. Obviously, right now we're on a different blending mode, so it's not going to look green. But as we scroll through, we'll see different colors here. So if we want to see through it like we did before, we'll just keep going through them until we find the one that we like. And that's actually back to normal. So um, you can have it normal like this if you want to, uh, or you can go down to, I think it was overlay is how it comes. There we go. Now it shows through and there's actually green in it now instead of the blue color. 
So you can do that. You can also turn off all these lights up here. Um, there was one thing that I was I noticed and we're going to try to fix, but if you've already downloaded this before we fix the file, you'll notice that there's a black line up here at the top of this. Um, that's just the light that's back there. So what we'll need to do is just grab the light bursts that are on this side and just go ahead and um, we'll drag those up. Let's see, that's the actual right lights copy there. There we go. Just drag that up, fill up that top spot. Perfect. All right, so that's something you might want to adjust. If that hasn't already been adjusted when you've bought the template, just make sure you make that adjustment. Um, but anyway, that's pretty much it. You can always turn these off, uh, the right goals on and off. You can turn both goals on and off. Uh, you can also change the color of the goals. We've added this little feature on here. The color overlay that's on each goal, if you just double click on color overlay, you can now actually change the colors of the goal if you want. And it'll add that color hue to the actual goal. So if you want to actually change those to a, a color as well, you can. So that is pretty much how you change the colors on this template. And when you're done, all you need to do is just bring in your already extracted images that you can get um, from our service on photosolutionsmarket.com called Servo. If you want to check that out, it's on our homepage. Scroll down a little bit and you'll see the ad for Servo and they do image extractions and they come back just like this and you just pop them right into your template. So thank you again for coming by. Again, my name is Sean with Photo Solutions Market and Spotlight Photographics. Have a great day.